I'm Stacy Brooks for Short Takes with Gambo today. Afternoons with Dave Burns on Arizona Sports, now at 98.7 FM. Yeah, good show. I agree with that. All right, we've got a question emailed from Todd Miller. Wanted your thoughts on the draft this weekend, specifically the Cardinals, and who will make the most immediate impact day one? You know, I didn't love their draft overall, but I will say that their first-round pick, Deion Buchanan, is the guy that should make the most immediate impact. One, they have a need for a safety, so he fits right in. The only thing I don't like about him is he's kind of a headhunter, and those type of players don't exist in this league anymore. They've changed the rules a whole lot, so he's going to have to play a little bit differently. He's not a great cover guy at the safety spot, but he's a good player out of Washington State, and he is going to play right away, so that's why I think he'll have the best impact. Tell me about Johnny Football. He went in the first round. Some people thought he would go earlier. He went at 22nd, I believe. Some people said, no, he won't go in the first round. What were your thoughts? My thoughts is I feel bad for the kid. He ended up going to Cleveland. Cleveland, they don't win in anything. They haven't won a championship since the early 60s with Jim Brown, so it sucks for him that he ends up with a terrible franchise that has made the playoffs once since 1999, has had six straight seasons of losing 11 or more games. A lot of it is where you end up. If you end up in a good system with good coaches and a good foundation and good ownership, you have a chance to succeed. Johnny Manziel has been set up to fail because he got drafted by a pathetic organization in Cleveland with the Browns. So as good as he is, and I like him as a quarterback, he's in a really bad spot in Cleveland because they just don't win. All right, last question. Just curious, when you look at the NFL draft and how it's changed, I feel like it's a red carpet event now. People actually sit down with popcorn and watch this, what, three days. Is it a good thing or a bad thing in your opinion? You know, it's good for the NFL, but they keep pushing it further and further, you know, back time-wise, and now it's interfering with the NBA playoffs, and it's interfering with the NHL playoffs. I have a feeling that the NFL doesn't care about anybody but themselves, and this Roger Goodell, the commissioner, not a big fan of his. I think he's a goofball, and uh, he's just all about the popularity. Here's the one thing you got to remember. The NFL is a big sport here in America, but it's not worldwide. Like, basketball is a worldwide sport, and, and soccer is a worldwide sport. The NFL would like to get there, but they never will, but they are dominating the ratings here in our country. What I love about you is I always know exactly what you think when we talk. Love it. Exactly. All the time. <laughs> hey, if you've got a question for any of our hosts, either on Arizona Sports or on KTAR, just shoot me an email, shorttakes at KTAR.com. I'm Stacy Brooks.